Today, I need to spread the word about one of my new favorite musicians. Stella Donnelly is an Australian singer-songwriter, and she is incredible. She's played in a few different bands over the years, but she just recently started working on solo stuff, and I'm completely in awe. In 2017, she dropped an EP called Thrush Metal, which includes a few of the songs off of the project that's going to be the main focus of this video. On March 8th, 2019, Stella released her debut studio album, Beware of the Dogs, and it is far and away my favorite album of the year thus far. It's this wonderful indie pop rock record that is filled to the brim with this one-of-a-kind energy and these expertly written songs. One of the best tracks on the entire album is Boys Will Be Boys. Originally released on thrush metal, this song came out when the Me Too movement was at its peak, and it's an unbelievably powerful, direct look at victim blaming and sexual assault. She's talked a lot about how much this song means to her, how personal it is, and how delicate it can be to discuss subjects like this. She'd like it to be empowering for victims to make their voices heard, but at the same time, she doesn't want to throw bad memories in their faces. I think the song executes this balancing act extremely well. The track itself sounds almost like a lullaby, it's so sweet and gentle, but the lyrics can be really straightforward and intense. And then the music video follows suit. It follows women doing these very ordinary activities. Stella said, It's like the day still goes on for these women, and you know justice might not happen, but life itself has to continue. If she cried to you for and these feminist themes continue throughout the album. The song Tricks is a lot more lighthearted, but it deals with Stella only being liked when she's doing what other people want her to do, and people telling her she'd look better if she dropped her attitude. It's much more playful. The instrumental and the lyrics both reflect that. There's one funny moment when she says, you want all of us to pull you out of the muck, you're always wanting a kiss, and then you want to get. But she subverts your expectations and doesn't say what you think she's gonna say. It obviously fits the theme of the song very well. The track Die is super hypnotic and fun. It's this dreamlike bubblegum pop rock that almost reminds me of somebody like Poppy, with its cutesy instrumental and sometimes dark lyrics sang in this almost frightening, gleeful manner. I don't wanna die, I'm looking forward, but I'm falling behind. I really can't praise this album enough. I love a good songwriter, and Stella is a phenomenal one. She can go back and forth between her own stream of consciousness thoughts and these huge macro societal themes so well. Her lyrics can be downright shocking and surprising, which seems pretty rare these days. The songs range from emotional and deep to amusing and humorous. She keeps you on your toes, and I don't think I ever really felt fully comfortable when I was listening to this for the first time. There's just so many twists and turns, and you never know what's coming next. And musically, Stella is great too. This album runs the gamut with different kinds of indie rock sounds. There are simple acoustic guitar ballads reminiscent of somebody like Sufjan Stevens, and then spacier, atmospheric sounds that seem closer to a band like Beach House or other dream pop groups. Overall, Beware of the Dogs is a great, great album. It's so different from any of the hundreds of indie rock projects that I've listened to over the past couple of years. Stella's songwriting shines through in magnificent ways. There's a bounty of fascinating tracks on this thing, all with their own distinct focuses. So, with the voice of an angel and lyrics that cut like a knife, I think Stella Donnelly is one to watch for the future. Go check this album out and let me know what you think. I really can't wait to hear your thoughts. Hey, thank you for watching this video. I am obsessed with this album, obsessed with Stella, and I really want more people to start listening to her. Uh, if you want to help out the channel, feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. You can follow me on social media, Instagram, Twitter, at RenshawHS. You can support my Patreon, buy my merch, whatever, and I'll see you soon. Thanks.